నెల్లూరు జిల్లా పరిధిలో రైల్వేల అభివృద్ధికి కృషి చేయాలని నెల్లూరు పార్లమెంట్ సభ్యులు వేమిరెడ్డి ప్రభాకర్ రెడ్డి దక్షిణ మధ్య రైల్వే జనరల్ మేనేజర్ అరుణ్ కుమార్ జైన్ ఇతర ముఖ్య అధికారులను కోరారు శుక్రవారం విజయవాడ సత్యనారాయణపురంలోని ఈటీటీ సెంటర్లో రాష్ట్రంలోని ఎంపీలతో దక్షిణ మధ్య రైల్వే బోర్డు నిర్వహించిన సమావేశంలో ఆయన ప్రసంగించారు జిల్లాలో రైల్వే పరంగా ఉన్న వివిధ సమస్యలను మీటింగ్లో ప్రస్తావించారు బిట్రగుంట్లో ఉన్న రైల్వే భూములను సద్వినియోగం చేసుకోవాల్సిన ఆవశ్యకతను ఆయన వివరించారు In future, I think that also will be missing. So I requested to take up some projects. I have been requesting past 4-5 years. Ratsabha I have represented that time, saying the same thing. Now again I have been representing. Because now a new boat is coming up there. There is a boat there, which is coming very just, I think, very near, for 25-30 kilometers. A seat that is there, which is also just about say 10 kilometers. So, lot of facilities are there. NH is also 10 kilometers. So, from Vitamota to NH is very near. All, in, if you take in any direction, you can put up any anything connected with your railway so that the land is utilized. And it has got everything. All infrastructure is there. All infrastructure. Even now, everything is there. Second is uh, our Nello station. I think it was awarded in 22. Now I think 50% of this is completed. And uh, you have given this for saying 6 months. I doubt, sir. The way I inspected this. I doubt it. No, yesterday, yesterday I was there. I voted the train. Ah. But the progress, I don't think, you know, it will happen yeah. again. So that's why I requested to put pressure on the who have the contract so that it is completed fast. The good project said for us also, and we need that also. And uh, other, as our minister just now, Chandrasekhar Gaur said, these ROBs and RUBs give us some freedom, sir. We are representing public. We are not going to, it's not for our own purpose or something. For the public's sake, we are you know, representing. So, lot of ROBs, ROBs, all are pending, lot of them are pending. Of course, you answered all of them saying that estimate or whatever. So, you would like you know, some, something which should be practical. Give us a deadline for that so that, okay, these ROVs or ROVs, whichever we are giving you, should be taken up and given some time frame so that at least we can answer the public who are been representing us. People, you know, go to our constituency, uh, first thing that comes, these things. So they say, we have got, you know, 20 aqua factories running there, or we are growing so much padding, we are doing this, we are doing that, railway crossing, we are getting blocks, uh, or, you know, 50 or 55 trucks are in, the, in queue there. So all these complaints, the practical complaints, we request you to take this seriously. So that at least, you know, we do something, we also serve the people. We want to serve the people, we are being represented by that. So let us also do something for them, more than anything. And that way you say no problem for funds. And our minister raised a good point actually. Because it helps everybody, all the MPs. Because all are answerable when you go back. So let us give us some importance in that. And also in our station, Zar Padu Padu in my constituency. This foot over bridge is totally closed. So what is happening now? People have to cross. How do they cross? What do you want? You can verify it is closed. Because they have been continuously representing me. And there is a gate also there. That gate you see nearby. There are about 50 or 100 vehicles, not nothing less. It is the ROV, very badly there. And these ROVs which you have taken single also, single are not enough also, we need double. These ROVs, whichever they are now going forward, 
you need at least to two of them in every place. Two at least. Otherwise, the, the population now has got up so much. What is again getting choked? Whatever you have also is getting choked at. So you find a cure even in this. So it's better if we go for two, two lanes. These also helps us. And some other Sir, hello. If a railway hospital can be established in Nello, because I'm, of course, this stoppage of trains, we have a lot of representation, sir. I don't know how to go about in this. Because you take uh, Tamil Nadu, you take Koramandal. The people have to go from Calcutta when they come to Nello, they have to go to Chennai get on in Chennai and again come back. And Nellore is quite populated and now today we have a lot of industries also. We have two ports now and industries are there, a lot of industries which are already there. So at least Koramandal and this, uh, the other one is uh, from uh, this place, what is that? These two trains, if they can stop, because they have to go otherwise to Chennai and come back. It's becoming a big problem. These two, please consider these, sir. I have been representing this also for a long time. Just five minutes is enough, even if you... Because you may not have too many passengers, but you have passengers, which uh, become very inconvenient and uh, not a representation. And the main thing I find is this Victor Bhutta, sir. So many all these employees who have retired, there's so many retired officials from the railways and, and all the infrastructure is there. And the land, if you see, I am sure next, if you see in another four or five years, you will find the land is come down to 200. Now today, if you ask me physically, there is only 400, 450 acres left. Even though it is not 700, it is nearly 950 acres. It is getting choked at. So you find a queue even in this. So it's better if we go for two, two lanes. These also helps us. And some other... Sir, hello. If a railway hospital can be established in Nello. Because, I'm, of course, this stoppage of trains, we have a lot of representation, sir. I don't know how to go about in this. Because you take uh, Tamil Nadu, you take Koramandal. The people have to go from Calcutta when they come to Nellore, they have to go to Chennai, get on in Chennai and again come back. And Nellore is quite populated and now today we have a lot of industries also. We have two ports now and industries are there, a lot of industries which are already there. So at least Koramandal and this uh, the other one is uh, from uh, this place, what is that? These two trains, if they can stop, because they have to go otherwise to Chennai and come back. It's becoming a big problem. These two, please consider these, sir. I have been representing this also for a long time. Just five minutes is enough, even if you... Because you may not have too many passengers, but you have passengers, which... Uh, becoming very inconvenient and a lot of representation. And the main thing I find is this Victor Bhutta, sir. So many all these employees who have retired, there are so many retired officials from the railways. And, and all the infrastructure is there. And the land, if you see, I am sure next, if you see in another four or five years, you will find the land is come down to 200. Now today if you ask me physically there is only 400, 450 acres left. Even though it is not 700, it is nearly 950 acres actually. From 950, you have mentioned 700 now. And now I am saying 450. Take this seriously sir. Because valuable land and it has got all facilities. You can come up with a good, uh, because I have represented even in uh, Delhi Minister to consider this. But it's also nearby from Nello. 
I mean, uh, from Chennai. Chennai, how far is it? It's not very far. If you set up something, you give employment also. We get employment also in our area. So these are my requests, sir. I hope you'll catch the this. We'll examine it, sir. So regarding ROB, just for the uh, information of honorable members, because initially ROB used to be sanctioned on cost sharing basis. And in most of the cases, since we were not uh, getting the funds from the state government, since those got held up. Then the policy came, he, all these ROVs will be converted into 100% regular funding, but utility shifting, land acquisition will be done by state government. Then again the same issue came. So now the policy is the okay, that for that also cost will be borne by railway. So though it appears if the ROV was sanctioned long back, five years back or ten years back, but now we are making it 100%, then the work will start. So that's why it appears that though the ROV was sanctioned long back, but work could not be started because we are already the debtor will get money back. So you should be forwarding it to the finance staff, which is a 50% hundred percent. But again, we have to start the debate, which is again, take time off. That's the request for your time. We do that, sir. Thank you, sir. I think you started the education that will be sanctioned. NL Hospitals, Super Speciality Mariyu Speciality Departments नंदु, अच्चुनत मैन नैपुन्यों कलिगिन आधनातन वस्तुलतो, विसिष्ट वैध्य सेवल अंधिस्तुन्ना, मा NL Hospitals द्वितिय वार्षिकोच्चवा स्रिभसंदर्भंग, नेल्योरु जिल्ला प्रजलकु, मित्रुलकु, स्रयोभिलाश